Hi guys, today we're going to go ahead and take a look at XOP, Xperia Open Source Project ROM for the T-Mobile LG Z3. This ROM will convert your LG G5 into an Xperia Z5. If you're a Sony whore and you have a T-Mobile LG G3, you can go ahead and install this ROM and keep whoring on. Alright, let's go ahead and take a look. Alright guys, check it out. I've got XOSP running on T-Mobile LG G3. Uh, for the LG G3, it is only available for this phone. It's also available for several other models of Android. Just go Google XOSP and the name of your phone. There may be a build for your phone. But this ROM is based off CM13. So you'll get all the CM13 features as you can see here. Uh, but uh, it does have really cool things that's going to... Oh, not really convert um, your whole phone into Xperia, but it's going to give you a lot of the features uh, from Xperia Z5. All right, first thing you will find is a Z5 launcher. So this is a launcher uh, straight from the Z5. Um, if you try to move any of the apps, you'll have to do it the Sony style. Go up there and then go like this. I don't know. I actually don't like the Sony launcher but that much. Uh, but for those of you Sony whores who love Sony products, um, you may love this uh, you may love the launcher. All right, also you've got a uh, music app. I believe this is actually the Walkman app. Uh, let me go ahead and open it for you. All right, so you get all of the features of a uh, Walkman app, all right? And also you get Sony Album. Um, I actually kind of like the Sony Album app. It's kind of chronologically uh, allows you to see all your photos and videos um, pretty easily. You got the little playback there. Also for videos, um, same thing here. Um, bunch of my stream, I'm not sure what that is, but that's there. Uh, there's a bunch of Sony apps, including Track ID, um, News app, Weather app, all of it from Sony. All right, that's pretty much it. Oh, also, yeah, you've got, um, there's like a little drawing app that's kind of cool. Sketch app, um, sort of sketching. That's from a Sony Xperia Z5. Right. Um, other than that, uh, there are XOSP settings, which give you some customization here. Uh, you'll see network traffic you can add. You can go ahead and disable the on-screen nav bar. Don't do that because you will not have buttons for this phone. Um, but you can go ahead and customize the buttons. This is kind of cool. I actually changed this button to um, torch, or you can change it to all these other things, or uh, menu button, which is really nice. And if you go ahead and save now, I'll be able to easily use flashlight. I and mean, for those of you who use, you know, a certain app or like the flashlight often, you can just play with this all day as a menu button. You can only add up to four though. All right. Um, also, you got slim dim, dim buttons after inactivity, uh, double tap to sleep, power menu. You can also enable screenshot. Right, screen. Uh, there's screen recorder app also on here. Um, buttons and layouts. Uh, there's also on the go mode. This is used to be my favorite uh, feature when I uh, like I think back in KitKat or something. That when it first came out. A lot of ROMs don't have it, but this ROM actually has it. So if you enable that and hold down the power button, you'll have this on the go mode. So like let's say you're, you live in New York and you walk on the streets and you want to be able to use your phone while walking you know um so this will give you that transparency uh, while you know you use your twitter um so you can see what you're doing while you're walking i don't think it actually i think it's supposed to work yeah there we go landscape so if your camera actually goes through here which is really cool right well it's a slightly different angle um but you get the idea and you can go ahead and turn this off easily all right, so you can walk safer if you absolutely need to use your phone. I think it's actually a pretty, um, pretty useful feature. All right. Other than that, that's pretty much it. Oh, you get also Viper for Android uh, for your audio, so you can tweak. Uh, especially if you use headphones, this thing's awesome. I have a, like a full tutorial guide on how to tweak this. Check that out if you haven't. Just go to my YouTube channel and look for it. All right, there's also OTA. Um, you can automatically update whenever there's new versions out. All these other things are pretty much CM13 stuff. Um, but the performance is excellent on this phone. 
So let's go ahead and run N22 real quick and let's see what kind of scores we get. Yo, 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 check it out, 47,634. Wow, that is a really, really good score. Um, So definitely check it out. That's pretty much it. XOSP ROM, Xperia open source project. Pretty awesome ROM. If you wanna get a refresh of your LG G3, or maybe you're a Sony whore, Sony whores be like, hello, awesome. I'm gonna go install that Max. Have a great day. And as always, stay on Android.